Windows 10's time is running out. In just a few months, Microsoft is pulling the plug, leaving millions of computers unsupported. No updates, no security patches, nothing. And while Microsoft wants you to buy a brand new PC for Windows 11, there is a good chance that your current one works just fine. So today, let's talk about what this means, why it's a huge problem, and what you can do to keep your computer running without wasting money. Microsoft is officially ending support for Windows 10 on October 14, 2025. After that, there will be no security updates, meaning your system will become vulnerable to cyber attacks over time. This is a pattern we've seen before. Windows 7, gone in 2020. Windows XP, ditched in 2014. And now, it's Windows 10's turn. The problem? Windows 10 is the most popular operating system in the world, running on nearly 70% of all Windows PCs. That's hundreds of millions of devices suddenly losing support overnight. Now, Microsoft's official response is simple. Just upgrade to Windows 11, but there's a catch. A lot of computers that run Windows 10 can't upgrade to Windows 11 because of strict hardware requirements, such as TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot. This means millions of perfectly working computers will either get thrown away or left behind, creating tons of e-waste, all because Microsoft decided to cut off support. And let's be real, most of these PCs are still fast enough for everyday tasks such as browsing, streaming and even gaming, but instead of letting you keep using them, Microsoft wants you to spend hundreds or even thousands on a new machine. If your PC is blocked from upgrading to Windows 11, don't worry, there's a way around it. One method is using a modified Windows 11 installer that removes the TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot requirements. Tools like Rufus let you create a bootable USB that bypasses these checks. Now, keep in mind that Microsoft doesn't officially support these methods, so future upgrades could break them, but for now, they work. If you want a free, lightweight, and secure alternative to Windows 10, Linux is a great option. Modern Linux distros are easy to install and come with all the basic apps you need. Web browsers, office programs, media players, you name it. Two of the best beginner-friendly options are Linux Mint and Pop OS. They look and feel familiar, so switching from Windows is super easy. And yes, you can even game on Linux. Thanks to Proton, thousands of Windows games run just fine, even on older hardware. If you're not ready to upgrade yet, you can still keep using Windows 10 safely for a while. Here's how. Use a good antivirus such as Bitdefender or Malwarebytes. Enable a strong firewall and update all software regularly. Avoid sketchy downloads and stick to trusted sites. So, what's the best option for you? If your PC can handle it, upgrading to Windows 11, even unofficially, is a solid choice. If you're tired of Microsoft's nonsense, Linux is a fantastic alternative. And if you want to hold on to Windows 10 a little longer, just be extra careful. At the end of the day, Microsoft's decisions shouldn't force you to throw away a perfectly good computer. There are always options. So, what do you plan to do when Windows 10 time is up? Drop a comment below and let's talk about it. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button and if you want more content like this, make sure to subscribe.